सो वेलकम बैक टू ई एस सिक्स ट्यूटोरियल सीरीज वेयर यू विल गेट टू नो द न्यू स्टैंडर्ड्स फॉर जावा स्क्रिप्ट लेट सी वॉट इज एक्चुअली द एक्मा स्क्रिप्ट सिक्स सो वॉट इज एक्मा स्क्रिप्ट एक्मा मीन्स यूरोपियन कंप्यूटर मैन्युफैक्चर एसोसिएशन दिस इज एसोसिएशन ओके दैट्स गुड बट वॉट इज दैट मीनिंग ओके द जावा स्क्रिप्ट कोर लैंग्वेज फीचर्स आर डिफाइंड स्टैंडर्ड कॉल्ड एक्मा ओके एंड द लैंग्वेज डिफाइंड इन दिस स्टैंडर्ड इज कॉल्ड एक्मा स्क्रिप्ट so in a simple word the acma script is just the standard or simply the way of writing java script for uniformity of code so java script in browser and node js is a super set of acma script okay so let's just talk about the little bit history of uh, java script so java script was created by brendan ake at netscape and he was told to create something like java and i think you know about the mozilla the firefox company so the mozilla project is also created by the brendan and he is very good so get back to the java script brendan was told for creating something like java and he has created this script called java script but initially it was released in 1995 and not named at java script it was named at mocha and eh? mocha yeah okay <laughs> doesn't matter mocha and then the live script and then they come up with a new name called java script actually before creating the java script java language is a very famous because it's a great language and because of the popularity of java they named java script to gain some popularity for their language okay get back to acma script so finally why we need actually the acma script initially when the java script was released every browser has its own version of java script which creates problem because if you create a page then that page will going to have different type of functionality going to be look different in different browser okay so to have a common standard between the browsers for javascript the ecma script come into the picture okay so what it will do it will make the code uniform throughout the different browser so that if we create something for a particular browser that will going to be look exactly same in other browsers okay so acma script versions what are these versions so in 1995 javascript was released and after 2 years they realized the need for acma script so 197 they released the acma script 1 and then 2009 acma script 5 was released but wait what about 2 3 and 4 Okay so in 1997 when the ecma script 1 was released just after they have released the 2 and 3 version they worked very hard on creating some more standards for ecma script 4 but they have talked about that but after that they will come up with okay i don't want to release the ecma script 4 let's release the fifth version so then they have skipped the fourth or not so famous version so 2009 ecma script 5 was released then 2015 ecma script 6 was released and in 16 ecma script 7 17 ecma script 8 and obviously these things will going in the future okay but in this series we are going to learn about only the ecma script 6 why not 7 and 8 because ecma script 6 is the major change and having great great functionality which i think you have to know and obviously we will cover acma script 7 and 8 in the future or in the new series somewhat but for now because acma script has great features we have to learn about this first okay so what acma script 6 will have various things lots of new features let const arrow function arrow function is my favorite classes and there is much much more some promises are there okay so we will cover each and everything about the acma script so with that let's start the journey of acma script 6 and we will meet in the next episode so till then don't forget to subscribe like bitfumes on facebook twitter and instagram so till then bye bye